Good evening, good evening, good evening. How's everybody doing tonight? Good to see everybody here for another BBGB. What's up, Ryan? Cuz. Fine Rider Sports Cards. How you doing, Greg? Good to see you. Joe Mann's been in the house. Cornet Collections. What's up, Tim? Michael Heath's in the house. How's everybody doing tonight? Cuz in the house, of course. Anyone catch the Pelicans win an OT over the Celtics? I did not. <laughs> I'm not a big uh not a big fan of uh regular season NBA. I do watch it in the playoffs, but regular season I really don't pay that much attention to it. So if everybody's doing well tonight, we're gonna wait a few minutes to make sure all the breakers if they wanna come in and hang out during the break. Uh, let's see, we got mostly everybody here. We're missing airtime and Stix G and Ron Fig. Well, Ron Fig likes to lurk in the corner sometimes and pop out and been like, I've been, been here the whole time. What are you talking about? <laughs> Man's been stopped watching NBA. Did something crazy happen, Greg, in that Pelicans win? I saw the the highlight of the uh, what was it the Warriors and the Hornets? <laughs> they called a technical on the dude because he was arguing with the refs. Because after that jump ball, they kind of wrestling on the ground, and they call it. They said the Hornets called a timeout, even though I think it would have been another jump ball. I mean, I think that was the right. Uh, I think they should have called another jump ball, but they gave it to the um to the Hornets or was it the Bobcats? I don't remember. Uh. Oh, wait, yeah, it's the Hornets again. They're not the Bobcats anymore, right? <laughs> Scott Reindeer Studios. What's up, my friend? How you doing? Sticks G in the house. What's up, Sticks? Here's one of our breakers. We're just waiting on Stimmers and Ron. Chilling like a villain. Chilling like a superstar. Scott calls everybody else superstars at the start of his streams, but he knows he's the, he's a real superstar. I mean, he was on he was on Conan. So, <laughs> what else could you, could you say? <laughs> Scott's the biggest superstar of his all. He's been on TV. <laughs> Zion had a big second half. Well, that's good for him, you know. He had all that hype surrounding him, so I'm glad he's doing well, especially to all the people that, you know, invested in Zion cards and all that. Cuz has been on TV a few times. I can remember only being on TV once, and it was the local news. They interviewed me about this neighborhood they were building. It's right at the end of the road. And yeah, that's that's my 15 minutes of fame, local news. <laughs> it wasn't even 15 minutes. It was like a 45 second clip of me talking. <laughs> We're all superstars are watching your silly videos. Zion is still risky, but he's so talented. Yeah. I mean, Zion reminds me of... I mean, I don't know how many people... Will, we're old enough to remember Charles Barkley when Charles Barkley was young, when he was a young player in the NBA. But that's who Zion reminds me of. I mean, I think Zion's a little more athletic than Charles was, but Charles Barkley was super athletic for a big man when he was young. And that's what Zion reminds me of. Ryan's playing NBA video game right now. Last year, Luca got called. As if it had been the other way around, that would have been Bedlam. Tim says, I was in a newspaper photo. That's about it for me. <laughs> Greg says, hope Zion's a better golfer. <laughs> Come on, that Charles Barkley swing is... That's something of legends, that golf swing. 
<laughs> don't think it don't change a thing about your golf swing, Charles. It's uh it's one of the funniest things I've ever seen. I mean it's not like I could swing any any better. I played golf like twice in my life. I'm lucky to hit the ball. We'll give it a few more minutes. See if Stimmers or Ron up in there. <laughs> Ron's dealing with the lag. Play mini mini golf and Xbox golf. Yeah, I had a. I remember back in the day, I had a Sega Genesis, and on that Sega Genesis, I had a golf game. And this golf game was just one course. It was Pebble Beach. It was called Pebble Beach Golf Links. Let me tell you what. I played that game so much when I was a kid that I was a master of Pebble Beach. Because I could, like, see them playing Pebble Beach on TV and be like, that dude hit it in the wrong place. <laughs> Mike hooks it every time. Stimmers is in online. It's all good. We still, we're still going to do the break. I'm just waiting to see if Ron and Stemmers pop in. I know Ron's got the most spots in the break, so hoping Ron's here in case any anybody wants to trade for his teams because he's going to end up with the most teams. Never play golf? I mean, try it. You might enjoy it. I mean, playing golf. I've had fun playing golf, but kind of an expensive hobby, you know, to get started in because you got to buy all the clubs and stuff. And then, you know, I mean, playing golf, whatever, it depends on the course you're playing at. It's really not that expensive to play golf. But just, you know, the clubs ain't cheap unless you buy some used ones. Mini golf in Pebble Beach. <laughs> so our cards, he said, yeah, yeah, that, I mean, that is also an expensive hobby. Very true. Very true. You can get more exercise with golf. OKC Thunder, 38, Denver Nuggets, 12. Is that a real score, Ryan, or is that your video game score? Sir Charles is definitely one of a gun. <laughs> oh, in your video game. I'm guessing you're playing as a Thunder, since you're winning. <laughs> Played the heck out of Skins game on Super Nintendo, yeah. I'm trying to think of the first golf video game I ever played. And I want to say... It was a... Uh, regular Nintendo game. On the, on the, the original NES. It was Lee Trevino Golf, I think it was called. Because it had Lee Trevino on it. And you could pick different characters to play, and like Lee Trevino's scores were all boosted up. Mean 18 was a PC DOS golf game? Okay. Was it called Nintendo Golf? I remember it had Lee Trevino in it. I don't remember what it was called. But I remember Lee Trevino was in it because there was a character called Super Lee in that game and all his stats were maxed out. Nintendo Golf and Mario. <laughs> Was it Lee Trevino's fighting golf? Cause okay, I didn't. I, there was a there was a Lee Trevino game on the original NES. That's all I remember. <laughs> Lee Trevino. All right, folks, let's go ahead and get started with the break. Maybe Ron can jump in and join us here in a little bit. Let's go ahead and pull up the pack picker and all that good stuff. I would never fight Lee Trevino. But you wouldn't fight Super Lee in the game, man. He was 
His stats are all jacked up. I know, right, Joe? That's why I was hoping he'd be in there. There, see? There's Ron. Ron's here. Told you he likes to lurk in a corner and be like, what? Been here the whole time. And Ron figs like the ninja. <laughs> it's like a West Coast ninja. All right. Flip this window. There we go. We can see all the breakers here. According to Zombie Ron is in many streams. That oh, that's true. Nothing wrong with stream hopping. <laughs> There's a lot going on on YouTube these days. So I mean, I do it myself. Waxman, what's up, Waxman? How you doing, John? Good to see you. <laughs> What's up, Giddy? How you doing, Giddy? Alright, so here's the breakers. Ron got five spots. Stimmers two. Greg got two. Sticks G got one. Airtime got one. Still missing airtime. Uh, Mansman got four. I know Jeff spends time with family on Sunday, so it's all good. By the way, wax on. Alright. Let's do a random check for the pack picker game. Took these first three gallery Bowman Chrome Donruss and Wax Pack Repack Bowman Chrome. Okay, randomizer is working. So we got Ron first. Ron, give me a number and then Stemmers if you happen to hear me. And in case you're wondering about BBGB number 40, that will be up on the site either tonight or tomorrow morning. Those that are subscribed to the newsletter from the website will get a email about it. Ron's going to go 23. All right, Wax Pack. Ooh, off to a tough start here. Uh, stimmers, last call for Stimmers. If you're in the stream, need a couple numbers, brother. Is 2021 in there? No. I don't have any 2021 yet. Uh, but next break, I'll have some packs of 2021 in there. Wife wants you to do the dishes. <laughs> oh, I guess that means you're doing the dishes, John. <laughs> All right. Ron, go ahead and give me uh, four, no four more numbers, sir. I'm going to circle back around to Stimmers if he pops in. E <clears throat> excuse me, voice crack there. Three seventy six twenty four. Three series two twenty twenty seventy six. Twenty nineteen Donruss twenty foe. Twenty twenty optic. One more, Ron. I see where you have a comma for a. Uh, number but it didn't show up on the chat yeah i know right late onset puberty <laughs> uh, 15 2018 diamond kings <laughs> ain't like wax on and wax off <laughs> miss trinity told me last night she'll work and i stay home and be mr mom hey there you go you gotta you gotta figure out the trade-off there mike <laughs> All right, next up on the pack picker is Greg. Two numbers, Greg. Eight. 
81 and 4. 81 is 2020 Tops Update. Bo. 2020 Gallery Mega. Not too shabby. We're looking for our first hobby pack. We got Stix G up next. You get one number, sir. Back double the dose of one of my meds. Makes me want to sleep all day now. Yeah, it's tough, man. Seventy seven for sticks. Seventy seven twenty nineteen down Russ. Next up is airtime. Jeff, you happen to be lurking. Now's the time to uh let yourself be seen. Pick a number. She likes painting decorative stuff on the wall. She makes good money if she promotes herself a bit. She an artiste, Mike? All right, uh, let's move ahead to Joe. Joe, four numbers from you, sir. Yeah, being an artist is tough. One. Series two. Ten. Diamond Kings 2017. 91. Another gallery mega pack. And a 100. 2019 Optic. Alright, back to you, Ron. Top of the order. Ron, go ahead and give me five numbers, sir, since I don't think Stimmer is going to pop in. Does that mean I'm tough? Yeah, yeah, Scott, that you're tough, man. And it's the, it's the beard. <laughs> A randomized picker in the setup. I could pick random numbers for the other ones, but I just give the picks to the other people on the break. Fifty-five, forty-four, thirty-three. Going the dough blaze. Fifty-five. Repack. 44, update, 33, another gallery mega, 99 and 100, 100's already been picked, Ron, give me a different number besides 100, 99, here's our first hobby pack, pro debut, pro debut, You think it was a chocolate covered raisin? Uh, well, hope for the best, John. <laughs> 69, dude. 2020 fire. All right, on to Greg. Two numbers from you, Greg. I didn't see ever see the new uh Bill and Ted's the the newest one that they made. Twenty seven and thirty one. Twenty seven Twenty twenty chop top, tops update and thirty one Stadium Club Hobby, there we go. Another hobby pack. Alright. Sticks G. Sticks G, give me a pack. I've been eating chocolate covered raisins and peanuts. Well, if it still has chocolate on it, it still, it still has a chocolate covered raisin. 
We can't be friends unless you've seen all three Bill and Ted. Oh, that's, uh, I didn't know that was a requirement, Scott. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> jump right on that one. <laughs> After the break. 21 for sticks. 21. 2019 Donruss. All right. Airtime. Skip over airtime. Joe. Joe, you're going to get the last four packs, sir. The last one's on par with Bogus. Okay, that's, that's watchable. So what are they doing Wayne's Wrong 3? <laughs> I don't know. After that commercial they did for uh, Uber Eats, I'm not too excited about seeing them again. <laughs> Didn't look like they were really in character for those commercials. Now I'm just in the kitchen staring at the dirty dishes. Uh, maybe if you stare long enough, John, they'll, they'll be done. <laughs> Chocolate-covered pretzel from Mall Rats. Oof, that scene... Uh, it seems rough. 14. Blaster bonus pack. You get 25. Another gallery mega. 32. Another pro debut hobby. And 34. 2018 Diamond Kings. And there's the break, folks. Um... Ron, give me a number between 1 and 25 for the repack. And Joe, give me a number between 1 and 5 for the bonus pack. <laughs> Joe, guys are really old now, like my age. <laughs> That's pretty good. All right, 13 on the repack. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6... 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. And then 5 for the bonus pack. The bonus pack is 2019 Diamond Kings bonus pack. Let me throw another repack in this box. For later. Isn't everything between here and there? Alright, let me copy these. Save BBGB number thirty thirty nine. Right. Like picking thirteen right in the middle. <laughs> makes the stream a little long what makes the stream a little longer? No big league, Joe, that's right. Check tracking on the package. It's stuck somewhere between here and there. Okay, I got gotcha. you. So I don't know where the between here and there came from. All right. Let's go to the draft board. Good luck, folks. We're going to randomize in three, two, one. Good luck. Ron got the Dodgers right off the bat. Cardinals. Stemmer's got KC, Texas, the White Sox, and Angels. Ron got the Rockies, D-backs, Tigers, Cubs, Astros, Athletics, Yankees, Mets. Greg got the Brewers, Nationals, Rays, and Orioles. Sticks got the Braves and Giants. Airtime got the Blue Jays and Padres. And Joe's getting the rest. Marlins, Mariners, Red Sox, Twins, Phillies, Engines, Pirates, and Reds. <laughs> yeah, Mansman called it. The Mets did end up on round fig. So I'm sure uh, Mansman's going to be hitting you up for a trade there. Listen is here now. <laughs> All right. I'm going to give you all a few minutes, five to ten minutes to work out trades while I pull all the packs needed. And I'll be radio silent, but I'll leave you all with some music to listen to. Be right back, folks.
All right, folks, I am back. Do we have any confirmed trades? Any confirmed trades? Mets for Seattle, Red Sox for Rays. All right, Seattle, Duran for the Mets. Oh, was the other one? Red Sox for Rays. Break out the Rays. It's the Red Sox. What's up, Wicked? How you doing? Frank B. Rippin. What's up, Frank B. Rippin? How you doing? Good to see you. Thanks for popping in, guys. Uh, Pirates are going to get a Wicked. Okay. Pirates go to Wicked. Right, happy birthday, Derek. Your birthday was this weekend, or is it this upcoming week? Or is it today? All right, any other trades? Any other trades? Last call for trades. Last call for trades. All right, take a screenshot of this, save it as well. Tomorrow. All right, that is saved. All right, let's get into the break. Teams are locked in. If you need to know what team you got, just ask. I can pull the screen back up. Let's go ahead and hide this. All right. Uh, we need to pick a budget hit pack. Ron, you got the most uh, spots in the break. So which uh, budget hit pack would you like? Every envelope full, one through ten. Hank. Twenty-five Perez. What's up, my friend? How you doing? Envelope. Number eight. More infinity. Whenever you want to look at it. Alright. Those were freshly refilled. After the last break, here's our twenty-four packs. Of random chaos. We'll do the wax pack first. We got 99, 1990 tops. Let's get the focus right before we get to ripping. Pretty close right there. Tim's back. Welcome back, Tim. 1990 tops for the wax pack. Some gum in there for cuz. All right, and we get us a Frank Thomas rookie in here, huh? Glossy All Stars and Prospects baseball cards, hot prospects. All right, we got a Cecil Espy, Mark Grace, Tom Foley, Mike McFarlane, Jose Alvarez, Daryl Strawberry, Andres Thomas, Brian Holton. Atley Haymaker, Calvin Giraldi, Daryl Boston, Jay Buna, Brian Holman. Is that a Buner? That's not a Buner rookie, is it? Buner's an 89, isn't he? Tim Tuffle, and Carmelo Castillo. 90 Tops Gum's the only one that ever made you sick. <laughs> Oof. That's rough. I'm late. Where's the hit dance? <laughs> uh, no hit dance yet. No hit dance yet. All right. Let's get into the budget packs, which are 2019 Donruss. 2019 Donruss.
tough set. Tough to get anything out of. Donner said really well. It's weird. Donner says up and down years. It, they're pretty good in 2018, and then 2019 is pretty bad. And then 2020 was pretty good. We got Mustakas. We got a Miles Mikolas variation. We got Adam Jones, Diamond Kings. Daniel Palka, Retro. Yachty. Belly. Garlicle Smanders. Kobe Allard Rookie. Kobe Allard Rookie. Seen that card plenty of times. Alright, next pack. Frank Thomas, no name. I wouldn't know what to I do with myself if I ever pulled one of those. Yachty. Jose Berrios. Diamond King. Harrison Bader. Reese Hoskins. Danny Jansen. Rated Ricky. The Bean Baller. Jose Urania. Carlos Rodone. And a Chris Shaw. Chris Shaw. All right. Last pack of 2019 Donruss. We got a Jose Ramirez Diamond Kings. Very underrated in the hobby. Bruce Hooper. Matt Chapman. Anthony Rizzo. George Springer. Another Reese Hoskins. Dupe. Oh, that's a... One of them was image variation, wasn't it? So one of them was a little bit... Or were they both the same? And I just wasn't paying attention. Now they're different. 104 and 104. 2019 makes it hard to see the... Different variations. They don't have the red on the back. So one of these is a variation. Just don't know which one's which. Jump for joy and go streaking down the road in your Nikes. There's a Jesus Aguilar and a Kyle Gibson. Don't call him Debbie. So, kind of tough sledding on the 2019 Donruss, but I will sleeve a J-Ram. I think he needs more love. He's really good. All right. 2017 Diamond Kings. How about a Mets hit? <laughs> We shall see. Hopefully we get a hit. J-Ram needs a hug. Alright, we got Joey D. Joe DiMaggio. Buzz Tuve. Lou Gehrig. Jim Bottomley. 12 RBI in one game. And Anthony Rizzo. I think that's a short print. Or a variation of some sort, because it's got the circle on the back instead of the great or the square portrait. I think that's a variation Rizzo. All right, we got 2018 Diamond Kings, two packs of this. All right, we got Crispy Flexin, rookie card, Trey Mancini. Here's a portraits of Tony Gwynn. It's pretty cool. Sweet card, graybeard Tony Gwynn. We got Billy Herman and Carlos Correa. Dold for airtime. And it's a very cool Gwyn card. I've never seen that one before. All right, next twenty eighteen. Kiki Coyer. Kiki, do you love me? Jose Altuve, another Altuve. Got a Trophy Club 
A.A. Ron Judge, Nelly Fox, and Kutch. Kutch with the San Francisco Giants. Nice little A.A. Ron Judge. All right, let's do 2019 Optic. What's up, John Klinsman? Thanks for stopping in. <laughs> you sorting? You sorting all your TTMs? All right, Optic 2019. We got a Glaber Day. JD Martinez. Like we got a Hollow in there. Ty France rated rookie. And our Hollow looks like a Diamond King. It is who that Rizzo? No, that is Joey Gallo. Joey Gallo for the Rangers. Nice little silver Diamond King there for the Rangers. All right, twenty twenty optique. Forty hours worked and three days clearing snow. That's tough, John. I'm glad we don't have to do that around here. <laughs> when it snows an inch here, everything just shuts down. Everybody waits for it to melt. <laughs> uh, we got Jonathan Daza, rated rookie. Buster Posey, Diamond Kings. And an insert behind that. Charlie Blackman. And our insert's a mythical, not a silver. Juan Soto. Very nice. Sweet Juan Soto there going to the Nationals. It's a nice little card. Been nicer for the silver. Sorry, my Indians cards. It's been all weekend. Might finish the bees tonight. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you, I guess you put them in alphabetical order. Yeah, the Silver Diamond Kings are nice. Got a Juan Marichal, Tito Fuentes, TTM, nice. Grats goodie. Eight inches of snow. That's a lot for Tennessee, ain't it? Almost a hit Dan Soto. <laughs> Could have been a Cool Cat Soto. This is a 2019 bonus pack. Of course, got the Babe Ruth card in it. This is the... It's a nice little Joe Adele here. Squires. This is the hollow foil variation. Vladdy Daddy framed. JD Martinez framed. Framber Valdez rookie artist proof. And a Babe Ruth collection. This is the last card. Uh, the checklist, I believe. Of that little set for the first card. Twelve inches, brand new snowblower purchase last year works great, nice. Vladdy Daddy framed is going to the Nationals in case anybody's wondering. There's Montreal down there, so that'll go to the Nationals. These frame cards are kind of a pain to get in these penny sleeves. More sleeves. Cool Cat's greater than Hit Dance, this guy says. Yeah, but you get a lot more Cool Cat than you do Hit Dance. Alright. Let's take a look at the repack. This is the repack that was picked by Mr. Fig. What's up, Smash? How you doing? You still in uh, West Virginia Smash? All right, we got a Donovan Osborne Silver Signature. Anduhar Sedeno Leaf Gold Rookie. Uh, Justin Turner Heritage. Gio Gonzalez. Wilson Contreras All-Star Game. Starling Marte. 
Making the mark. Colin McHugh, McHugh gold card. Out of 2019. Numbered out of 2019. Chris Sale, Pank. Pank Sale. From Optic. And 3 plus insert. That looks like a many. From Donruss. Pure power. With the glory old. Pure power. Numbered out of 5,000. 810 out of 5,000. Going to the Indians. It's Pank. All right. 2020 Fire. All right, we got Elvis Andrews, now a Oakland A. Domingo Leyva, rookie. There's a cool Manny. Uh, what are these called? Gold minted. Arms ablaze. Pretty cool little Manny Machado. Got a Jordan rookie. Jordan going to the Astros. Polanco. And a Lewis Thorpe rookie. Lewis Thorpe rookie. From Fire. Crazy says, hey, what's up, Gary? <laughs> yeah, Pod Rider, it's just a joke of how they say pink down here in the south. It's pink. It's a pink card. P A N K. You want you want a cool cat for Yordon? Alright. We have a request for cool cat. Cool cat incoming. That's cool. <laughs> it's not pink, it's salmon. What's up, Four Leaf? How you doing? Alright. We got gallery. Four packs of gallery. <laughs> Take a pink. Got ran up a tree today by what, dog? Look, another Yordan rookie <laughs> from gallery. Uh, we got a blue in here. Some, something blue. Look at that one last. But another Yordan rookie. It's two Yordans. George Springer. We got DJ Ch 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 Stewart. JT Riomuto. That's the look on his face when that pitcher ran out from the uh, dugout and he was kind of upset. I don't know what this blue card is. Oh, it looks like a throwback. Brendan McKay rookie. Throwback. It is numbered out of 99. 46 out of 99. A little bit chipped up on the edge there. But a Brendan McKay blue out of 99. No hit dance. No hit dance. Because for, for out of 99. But we'll give it another cool cat. For the 99. <laughs> I almost got cool cat dance. <laughs> I don't know if you're going to convince the hobbyist of that. You know, the hobbyist gets to see C-3PO shake his thing. Alright, next pack of gallery. All right. We got Colin Moran. We got a rainbow foil in here. Zach Gallen. Oh, look. I skipped the rainbow foil. Right to a Steven Gonsalves autograph. So, Mansman, you got your wish, my friend. 
Mansman, you got your wish. How about a Mets hit? And cuz, you got your wish, cuz you get a hit dance. But I gotta repair the lights. The lights aren't ready. <laughs> Joe Mansman called it again, for sure, right? All right, I got to switch hands for this so I can control the lights. All right, hit dance incoming. <laughs> I wasn't expecting a hit dance. I never expect a hit dance. Nice little hit dance for the Mets there. Steven Gonsalves will send him back here by the budget hits. All right, what's the rest of this pack? We got a Logan Webb rookie. There's a Zach Gallen. Our rainbow is an Aaron Judge. Aaron Judge. In case you're wondering, these rainbows are not numbered. <laughs> Much better than Cool Cat. Uh, are you just saying that because it was a Met hit, Joe? All right. Next pack of gallery. We got Junior Fernandez. Raphael Devers looking all contemplative at the sky. That cloud is beautiful up there. Wait, Kluba. Kluba needs an Uba. We got a Justin Verlander and a Yelly, Christian Yelich. All right. On to gallery pack number four. We got Trevor Bauer. He was just burping. Christian Walker. We got another, uh, we got a couple of inserts in there. Nolan Arenado. All right, we got another shiny rainbow foil. It's upside down. It's Whit Merrifield. I just saw the name. Whit Merrifield. Oh, okay. It's one of these cards. Whit Merrifield. And then we got who this? They're Cubbies. I've seen this card before. Is it, is it Santo or is it Sandberg? It's Santo, right? And Chris Bryant. Yeah, Santo and Chris Bryant. One of these days, we're going to see Scott in gallery. Reindeer Studios is one of the artists. Merrifield of Wit. <laughs> Do you have the reds? I don't know. Let's see. Uh, yeah, you do have the Reds, Joe. They couldn't afford Sandberg's likeness. You say no, thank you, Scott. Would you turn down a, a job offer from Tops to do some art cards? I'd love to see your charcoal stuff on an art card. Be pretty sweet. All right, this is a uh, 2020 Series Two. We got a skirty card. Skirty. Victor Reyes on the front. Victor. Luis Severino. Jay Up. The Scalafini. Keon Kella. Keone. We got a garlic. A Kyle Garlic. Vince Velasquez. We got something blue in here. Uh, John Birdie. Rookie. I think he's a little underrated too. He played well last year. John Birdie. Pedro Severino. Another Kluba needs an Uba. 
the now retired Dustin Pedroia. We'll look at the inserts last. Brave on the front is Cole Hamels. Braves legend Cole Hamels, who played like two games and got paid mucho dollars. All right, this blue card. Oh, very nice. It's a blue chrome turkey red. Very sweet, and it's another Met. Met's killing this uh this break so far. Are these numbered? Yes. At a fitty. At a fitty. I'll count that as a hit. I'll count it as a hit. Why not? Congrats, Joe. That's a cool card, man. You've seen one pulled? I've never pulled one. I've never pulled any colored uh, chrome turkey reds. Very nice. Add that to the stack over here. Rainbow foil. Wilson Ramos. Hey, look, another Met. Another Met getting a sleeve. And then regular turkey red. Will Clark. I <laughs> he's going to pass out with his dance overload. And then the last card was Joey Wendell. Mr. Wendell. Yeah. I meant to say never seen one pulled. Well, you have now. <laughs> Everybody in the room seen one pulled. I've seen it. All right. Next pack of 2020 Series 2. I need a Rosarena. All right, we got a Padres team card on the top. Padres team card. We got a Bomba Brothers with uh, who is that? Sano and Cruz. Shout out to Bradley Moore. Three's Company, Gallo and Andrews. We got Rich Hill, Chad Pender. Breaking out the Arrested Development, right? Jake Fraley, Ricky, Waka Waka Waka. We got Dakota Hudson, Nomar Mazzara, CJ Cron, Carlos Carrasco, now I'm it. Josh James. We got a gold, Brian O'Grady, Ricky Gold, numbered 966 out of 2020. We got a turkey red Nick Solak with the rookie logo. Brave New World with Acuna and Albies. And a Nick Ahmed. Nick Ahmed. <laughs> Fuzzy the deer again. Uh, what are we going to do with you, Mike? Nice little chrome. Oh, I didn't mean to put the stack on this stack. All right. Three packs of updates, and then we get to the hobby packs. Then to the budget hits. But don't go anywhere once we do the budget hits, because we do a recap of the break. And we go to the wheel. All right. Update. Chris Sale. We got Jump On 6. We got Kipnis, who's now Brave. Verlander. Pedro Stroop. Let's turn these the right way. Jorge Alcala, rookie for the Twins. Brad Peacock. Nick Solak, rookie. Rookie debut. Tyler White. There's a Tatis. 85 design, not too shabby. We got a Mark Grace, Turkey Red, Ellie, Lindblom, Pedro, Gizmero Pettit, and a Chris Sale. Yeah, 
you're having a good break? I'd say so, Joe. <laughs> With that blue chrome and the, the hit so far. Say so the Mets are doing pretty well. Ship you off to Australia. <laughs> Would that really be punishment there, Mike? <laughs> There's that jerk four leaf. Filling in for Austin on the night by eight. Bryce Harper. We got Kenley Jansen. We got the kid, King Griffey Jr. Like we got a rainbow foil on this one. Josh Fuentes. Yadi. Kenta. Todd Frazier. He just signed with the Pirates, didn't he? Chrissy Anetta. We got Miles Straw. Ooh, Big Mac Rainbow Foil. Very nice. Big Mac. Our turkey red is Kim from the Cardinals. We got Kyle Crick. Albert Pujols. Steve Shishek. Frank Schwindel. And Brian Johnson. <laughs> sure it's fun with the sales pitch. <laughs> Just the, it's just the timing there. For <laughs> uh, not really unless you want to send to South Korea. <laughs> There's Austin. Austin, you missed the night by eight already. But I know you brought more, would you? All right. Last pack of updates. This one's got Skirty in it. Skirty. Alright. We got another rainbow foil in here. There's a regular Big Mac. Stanky Granky. Kyle Farmer. Jarrell Cotton. Brock Holtz. Steve Wilkerson. Chase Anderson. Adam Engel, Eric Mejia, nice little Willie Mays numbers game, John Smoltz, Turkey Red, Trent Grisham, rookie debut, Fegley, David McKay, Richard Blyer, and Diego Castillo. So no rainbow fool on that one. Guess my eyes are playing tricks on me. Grisham, Smoltzy, And Willie Mays. All right, folks. Let's get into these hobby packs. We got one hobby of a stadium club and two hobbies of Pro Day Butt. Send you the Antarctica with no clues. This one feels kind of heavy. Is there a hit in here? I don't know. This pack just feels kind of heavy, but it could be because all these other packs are light. I don't know. I think there's a thicky in there of some sort. Where they're just stuck together. Alright. First card. Bubba Starling rookie. Gotta love the photography on Stadium Club. We got Kyle Schwaba. We got Austin Riley. Just in case you wanted to see what his backside looked like. We got Josh Hader. We got Mike Yastrzemski with the original Yaz right there. We got an Acuna. What are they called? Bash and Burns insert. Not too bad. Mr. Ronald Acuna going to the Braves. We got Bang Bang Bregman. And the card in the back is Max Kepler. Max Kepler. I got a thing. <laughs> well, thanks, Scott. It's not, probably consider that one TMI, but thanks, Scott. <laughs> Could we have a three hit dance show? I don't know. It's a possibility in pro debut. Yeah, two more packs to get that there. Cuz. Alright. Pro to butt. Which probably had loaded up two expectations coming out of his draft. 
Yeah, he was a high draft pick, wasn't he? But, like, was stuck in the minors forever. All right. Is anyone able to explain why some of these update cards look like they were taken in a, in a single a stadium? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I still don't understand that. It's not a bad card on the, on the top there. Mr. Bobby Witt Jr. We got a Xavier Edwards. We got a Nick Quintana. There's a Pache. We got an insert. Norlin, Nolan Gorman. Tape measure power. We got a Gray Kessinger. Kyle Mul Mueller for the Braves. And a yeah, Joey Cantillo. Joey Cantillo. A couple of good cards in that pro debut pack. I always got to look at the backs of these because I don't ever recognize the parallels in this. Nolan Gorman. Pache, or Pache, however you want to say it. And a Bobby Witt Jr. Alright, folks. Last pack. Last pack for the budget hits. Thank you all for hanging out with us tonight. It's been a lot of fun. A lot of fun this stream. We've seen Cool Cat. We've seen Hit Dance. All right, we got Diego Cartea, Tyler Freeman, Orvelis Martinez, or Oral, Oralvis, Oralvis, or Oralvis. We got Helio Ramos, Foster Griffin, Casadores de Tormentas. Got a Jackson Kowar. Mackenzie Gore. He's supposed to be really good, isn't he? And an Andres Jimenez. Andres Jimenez. Of course, part of the Lindor trade. What's the record for head dances? I don't... Oh, I mean, we've had plenty with two head dances. I don't think we've had any with three head dances. So... Two seems to be about the ceiling. Not the tail end, not of a woman. All right. It's all good, Austin. Thor was part of Florida Gators pitching rotation that had Brady Singer's race. Yeah. I don't like the Gators, so. <laughs> all right. First budget hit. Dun dun dun. It is a Jonathan Bolin. Jonathan Bolin from Elite Extra Edition. Very pretty signature on there. Going to the Kansas City Royals. Jonathan Bolin. You don't see autographs like that on prospects too much. Unnumbered. Uh, not anymore there, Bradley. <laughs> He's a stud prospect. He's now a stud prospect for the uh, Indians. We got a Brooks Hall. Brooks Hall going to the Milwaukee Brewers. This one is numbered out of 819 from Elite Edition. That's right. Go Canes. Bum, bum, bum. We got a Francisco Mejia. Francisco Mejia Signature Series. That's not a very nice auto. Francisco Mejia going to the Cleveland Team, whatever they're called now. Might be Florida Day, so they took two out of three Florida on opening weekend. That's surprising. Dun, dun, dun. We got a Topps Inception, Richie Martin. Topps Inception, Richie Martin, on card, auto. This one is not numbered, but it sure is purdy, and it's a thicky. Inception, Richie Martin going to the Oakland A's. Oakland A's. All right, folks. That was the break. Let's do a quick recap of everything we got. 
You think it was a fair trade? You think Jimenez is that good? I don't know. I don't know. It's tough to give up a superstar player like that, though. You know, to Lindor. <laughs> you had to give me no tears for me. He auto hate that guy. <laughs> All right. So here's the hits again. The budget hits. Richie Martin auto, Mejia auto, Brooks Hall auto, and a Jonathan Bolin auto. That was a good envelope pick there. Ron had all autos in it, no relics. Go over the sleeve cards. Uh, we got Mackenzie Gore, Foster Griffin insert, Bobby Wood Jr., Pache, Nolan Gorman insert, Yaz. I sleeve that because it's got the original Yaz on it. Acuna, Bash and Burn, Willie Mays, Numbers Game, Smoltz, Turkey Red, Trent Grisham, Rookie Debut, Big Mac, Rainbow Foil, Kim, Turkey Red, Rookie, Solak, Rookie Debut, Tatis, 85, Mark Grace, Turkey Red, Brian O'Grady, Gold Card, Solak, Turkey Red, Rookie, Will Clark, Turkey Red, Wilson Ramos, Rainbow Foil. The Noah Syndergaard Blue Chrome Turkey Red out of 50. Whit Merrifield Rainbow Foil. Santo and Bryant Master and Apprentice. Verlander inserts. Heritage Collection. These aren't sleeved. They're in the wrong stack. Aaron Judge Rainbow Foil. Jordan. Rookie. Brandon McKay Blue. Heritage insert. This one's numbered out of 99. For the Rays. Jordan, Fire Rookie. Manny Machado, Gold Minted, or whatever these are called. Arms Ablaze. Chris Sale, Pank. Colin McHugh, Gold. Starley Marte inserts. Oh, these are from the repack. Those don't need to be in there. Joe Adele, Hollow Foil Parallel, Squires. Laddy Daddy, Framed. J.D. Martinez, framed. Remember Valdez, artist proof in the Babe Ruth collection card. And then we got Juan Soto, mythical from Optic. It's a pretty card. Joey Gallo, silver from Diamond Kings Optic. Trophy Club, A.A. Ron Judge. Tony Gwynn, portraits. Jim Bottomley, memorable moments. Rizzo, Image variation from Diamond Kings. J Ram, Diamond Kings. And the Pure Power, Manny Ramirez, numbered out of 5,000. From 90. I don't know what year this is. Mid 90s, Donruss. That's all I could say. <laughs> Alright, Mike, you have a good night, sir. Thanks for hanging out with us. Really appreciate it. Alright, let's go to the wheel. Oh, I forgot about the. Steven Gonsalves gallery autograph unnumbered. Alrighty. Let's get the wheel pulled up here. All right, everybody that was in the break. Has a spot here on the wheel. We got Ron Fig with five, Stemmers with two, Greg with two, Six G with one, Airtime Mansman. Oops, I forgot to copy and paste Mansman. Mansman four times. And then Six G has a bonus spot on the wheel from not winning on previous wheel. Working on a trade to have Adele auto out of Fitty. Bunch of numbered Adele's for a numbered auto Adele. <laughs> trying to trade up since I pulled an Adele finally, right? Alright, so I'm going to shuffle this until somebody in chat tells me to stop. And then we'll spin from there. <laughs> Finally, Austin says stop. <laughs> it's taking me over a year to pull a double. I mean, he's only in, in Prospects product. <laughs> All right, folks. 
First name it lands on is going to get the voucher. 775 for this voucher, I believe. Isn't that what I charge for this? All right, 775 for this voucher. Good luck. <laughs> voucher is going to Stemmers. Congrats, Stimmers. I will send that to you in an email. All right. So we're going to remove one of yours. We're going to spin again. The next three are for repacks. Do you get fired, Austin? I always just say, damn it, after telling someone what, what to do. Oh, I got you. That was part of the joke. <laughs> Mr. Fig, maybe. Yep. Move one of yours. We're going to spin again. Fig. Two times in a row. This wheel loads it some Ron Fig. And some Joe Mansman for that matter. <laughs> Alright. Last repack. Say it ain't so. <laughs> Ron Fig. Wow. <laughs> that is a first. You guys have seen a BBG first tonight where the same person won all three repacks. That didn't even happen when Stemmers bought like 13 spots. <laughs> Congrats, Ron. All right, so that means Greg, Stix G, and Joe Mansman. It's been a while since you got a bonus spot, Joe. Joe Mansman. I'll get plus one to the wheel. All right. <laughs> Rigged, I know, right? <laughs> it's the first time that's ever happened. All right, let's hide this. All right, so the voucher is going to go to Stimmers, Repacks, Fig, 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 and then Greg, Stix G, and Joe get plus one on the wheel next to break your in. That's figged up. <laughs> All right, Ron. Three repacks coming your way, sir. It's figged. Rigged for Fig. <laughs> it's a fig rig. <laughs> Three numbers, Mr. Rig. I mean, fig. Three, fifteen, and twenty-three. So one, two, three. This one has Jim Abbott on the front. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Oh, wait, you want a fifteen? This one's got Brandon Belt on it. I'm going to count from the back. Twenty-five, twenty-four, and twenty-three. This one's got cakes on it. Nick Marcakis. <laughs> it was rigged. What up, MSC? How you doing tonight? Good to see you. Thanks for stopping in. It's not rigged, it's figged, apparently. Alright, first pack, Ron. First of three. This one had Jim Abbott on the front. Alright, Ron, you get Wade Boggs. You get Manny Ramirez. Uh, Crown, or Future Attractions, about to say Crown Royale. Taiwan Walker. Future is now. You get a Max Kepler. There's the Abbots. You get a JD Martinez Optic. You get a Team Franklin Altuve. 
And you get a Manny Machado, Jackie Robinson Day. Hold on, let me get my chat back right. Had a lot of cake this weekend, mom's birthday. Well, happy birthday to Austin's mom. Oh, terrible as always. Sorry to hear that, MSC. Your insert in this one is... Looks like a gallery. How about a Marwin Gonzalez autograph? A Marwin Gonzalez autograph. So congrats on finding an auto. And repack. Thinking about purple bags. <laughs> All right. Next pack for Ron. This one with Brandon Belt on the front. You get a Locaine. You get a Minnesota Johnson. <laughs> you get a Adam Johnson. And a Dave Justice Pinnacle. Joe Cotta, 90 score. There's the belt. You get a Rico Bronia gold medallion. You get a Orlando Miller platinum from metal. You get a Yaziel Puig Gypsy Queen insert. Looks like you got a mini here because I don't see no card in there. It's a mini. The U Darvish from Diamond Kings mini. U Darvish from Diamond Kings mini. <laughs> What's up, crazy? How you doing? We just finishing up our break here, sir. On the last repack. This one's got cakes on the front. You get a Paul Mulder studio. Jose Leclerc. Reese Hoskins insert. You got a Kevin Crone. There's the cakes. What's up, Spidey? You get a Contreras, Turkey Red, you get a Gold Mazzara, you get a John Lesta code card, and your insert is... Looks like Rendon. Anthony Rendon Red from opening day. Unnumbered, but a red parallel. So thank you, Mr. Fig. You always scare Austin off. <laughs> Alright guys, that does it for BBGB39. It's in the books. Appreciate all y'all hanging out with us tonight. Been a lot of fun. Let's get the focus right so you're not staring at my blur disc. I got some sorting to do. Hopefully I get through it tonight before I uh, pass out. I'm pretty tired. Uh, if you're looking forward to getting into a future uh, BBGB break, which will be BBGB 40, will be the next one. Uh, that should be live on the site tonight or tomorrow. Um, but if you're signed up for the newsletter on the website, you'll get an email on it uh, when it goes live. But until then, I should be live again on Tuesday night for another Cardboard Happy Hour and again on Thursday uh, for the end of the month Cardboard Happy Hour. Yeah, and if anybody's got any questions, feel free to reach out to me, cardobbies at gmail.com. It's also on the YouTube channel. If you go to the info, uh, you can get my uh, email information. But for the rest of it, y'all have a great evening and a fine start to your week. Uh, don't work too hard, and I will catch you all live again on Tuesday, and I'll probably see you in a stream uh, sometime tomorrow night, because I can't. For some reason, stay off YouTube. It's like addicting. But uh, later, everybody.